I know you're thinking to yourself like, every man getting chosen but you, and you a quality dude, you're healthy, you got God in you, you know what I'm saying? You got money, I mean, you're working hard on stuff, you got money, or you're ambitious, you're healthy, you, you got a good attitude, no, you're not perfect, nobody, who is perfect? Nobody perfect. But you, you should definitely have your piece of the pie, and I know a lot of you guys thinking that, like what is wrong, what is going on? The problem is that you're so unique that um, people think that they never knew people like you existed and they're not really familiar with it. It takes a very unique woman to deal with a man that's a real man. Because what they think is a real man is not a real man. And sometimes they're trained to be, they're more comfortable around fake men because that's what they're used to. They're not used to the, a real man's frequency. They're not, they're not used to a real man's frequency, so they mistake different they mistake his frequency as controlling or arrogant or narcissist. They mistake his they mistake his nature, his, his strength as controlling. They, they, they're looking at it all the wrong ways. And they're getting guys that they can override and they can control, you know. And it seemed lovable. The world is that it seemed lovable. You know what I'm saying? It seems lovable, you know, because if it's easy to love what you think you can control, you know, it's like a kid, it's easy to have that, uh, you know, to love something that's harmless, that seem harmless, or something that seem, uh, it, something that seem harmless or something that seem controllable, it's easy to love that because you think you got it in the control, but it's not real love, it's just, comfortable it's just called being comfortable in, with what you're familiar with real love is unconditional it's agape you know it's based on loving somebody for their mind heart and personality you know not just because you can control them i love your personality because i can control you that ain't love if you if every if you, you're not considering the other person's feelings even if you're right or wrong you still you know what i'm saying you can't love something just because it's comfortable, you know, you love sugar sweets because it tastes good, but it's bad for you. That ain't, you know, love is not all pleasure. You know what I'm saying? Love is not all pleasure. <clears throat> we, you gotta, people who have learned to love what they can control and what they what tastes good. They need to learn how to love what's best for them and what has the best intentions for them. That's what, and what's willing to make the best sacrifices for them. Uh, you know, the devil has screwed up our mentality for love because the devil don't like love. We all know the devil don't like love. You know what I'm saying? The devil don't like love, man. But uh, that's what's going on out here, y'all. You got to understand that. That, bro, you're going to get yours, man. A unique woman going to come your way and, and, and she's going to appreciate everything about you. And she gonna make everybody else realize that, you know, she gonna make everybody else realize what they've been missing. A lot of times people can't see the good in you, you know. They can't see the good in you until somebody else do. All it takes is one girl, to, one female, one woman to change your life and everybody else gonna be able to see everything else you see. You know what I'm saying? It's wild world, man. A lot of times, people that seem like they don't deserve it, they get it, they get it. And the people who do deserve it, they without, some of the most loving guys in the world are lonely. They work, they work, work out and come home. Get Vaseline and yinky, yinky, yinky. And beating their head, squeezing their hand bone because they can't get none because they, uh, most of the women getting, giving it their bodies to Pookie and Ray Ray and to guys who don't love them and guys that's on, substances unhealthy guys eating mech eating all kind of fast food and all kind of stuff but they're not giving a godly men that's healthy that's doing you know not perfect but it you know they, they pretty much leaning they harder on a godly man that make one mistake versus an ungodly man that make thousands of mistake you know what i'm saying so it's all good you're gonna get yours bro in due time trust me I plead the blood of Jesus Christ. I holler at y'all later, oh man. Follow me on Instagram at Alan Ray and that show you want a consultation. Uh, hit the like button, subscribe button, notification bell button. Let me know if you want a health conf a health consultation or regular consultation about life or women or whatever. 
and uh, share my videos to your Facebook, TikToks, and Instagrams. I'll holler at y'all later, man. God is good. One love. We out. Uh, I, I download my latest music at a uh, um, my latest two singles uh, that's available. It's Pookie and Ray Ray Song Challenge featuring Country Wayne and uh, and Big World of the Regionaire. I got new music on its way now. Uh, I mean, I got new music out, but I got it's gonna be available uh, this week. I'll let y'all know when it's available. But uh, I'll holler at y'all later, man. Be safe. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. Give your life to Jesus now. Don't wait too late. Because the next moment ain't promised, man. He real. If you wasn't real, I wouldn't tell you. I holler.